thousands taking the street of Havana and at least 14 other cities in protest over the weekend, demanding an end to the 62-year dictatorship and protesting the lack of food and COVID vaccines. They were the biggest protests in decades in a country with tight police control and surveillance on dissidents. Demonstrators attempted to broadcast the protests live with their cell phones, but Cuba's authorities cut internet service on multiple occasions. Yesterday, NBC News reported that streets of Havana were quiet overnight and there was a heavy military and police presence. There were also pro-government groups in the streets and sections of the city where protesters clashed with the police earlier yesterday. And the eyes of the world are on Cuba. The world now can see clearly the true face of the Cuban government.